Okay. Tracking your food diary. Ke khai ra kuchu daily basis ma chai kati calories mai consume gai ra kuchu. At the same time protein intake dekh lera aur deficit pa chaki hai na. To sabai tracking garna saknu huncha tapai le. My fitness pal app use garna saknu huncha. Overall at least per day tapai ko calories kati tapai le consume garnu bhayo, protein intake kati consume garnu bhayo, fat, carbs so on so forth tapai le information chai herna saknu huncha jase gada it will give you some guidance. Ra tapai le yo chai at least for a week garnu bhayo ani ke huncha bhanda khari hopefully by then tapai ko chai euta habit huncha in terms of बॉडी अवेयरनेस होना है ना तब पहले जाए आप ले फूड क्या खाए रहे कुछ कुछ जाए हेल्थी फूड हो कुछ कुछ अनहेल्थी फूड हो दो टाइप ऑफ डिसीजंस होपफुली तब पहले जाए आफ्टर वॉल यू शुड बी एबल टू डिसाइड एंड मेक दैट सेंसिबल डिसीजन है सो इट्स नॉट फॉर एवरीवन इट्स टू बी एबल टू स्ट्रॉ if you are really having issues with your health, this is something that I advise you to track down until you are happy and content. Okay, next one is exercise. Yes, we all know that exercise is important, but how often do we do that? And then what type of exercise do we do? As a starting point, let's say at least a couple of times a week, a weight training or nose. Combine that with the cardio exercise as a joint effort you're gonna get really good benefit you know, because you have addressed the strength element which means you're gonna have really good muscle recruitment gain more strength working on the cardio element it really have the whole cardiovascular system to work more optimally so where possible i would advise you to combine the weight training and the cardio a couple of sessions per week to get the maximum benefit from this session the other one is Protein intake is really important uh, when you start to do more exercises like weight training and cardio elements because it helps especially when you start exercise and you start to become more active and because it helps with the muscle recovery, muscle mass retention and gain and so on. Number four. Sleep is important. So I would recommend six to eight hours at least. In the type of ramos and pugyo, then type of brain go function down to the following day you'll have more energy. And in type of personal professional calm and open your health also because you can focus more and you don't feel lethargic. Therefore, you can go to the gym or you can go out there and do some workouts and exercise at the same time. So there's lots of benefit that comes with it. Hydration, you know, so hydration is really important. You know, hydration again, it helps with our body function. You know, our brain almost contains seventy percent of water. Our body is almost sixty percent of water, which helps to function our organs optimally. So hydration, like you don't just have to stick to plain water. You know, your tea, coffee, all counts. Again, two liter is sort of recommendation, but again, it depends. It varies depending on the environmental factors. If you have a hormones, and obviously the intake will go up, you know. And if you have a workout, so like the hair and you have a switch, then you have to do exercise, go to shower, and then yes, then you have to again increase your intake of the water. Right? So it, again, it depends on the environmental factors and where you are exposing yourself to, right? So these are the five areas that if you can consider in your lifestyle